barstools. The wood is rotting, so I've strategically chosen not to sit on them. It's some book Sally's been reading. She insisted that we bring it with us, although I'm not sure why. X of the Helmsman by Looks G. like Sally's read through it a couple of times already. I wonder what's so interesting about it. Fishing trips on board the dearest Selina. I'm guessing that's the name of the ship. Inquire with Felicia Stone Top at the bar or with Sylvia Seafoam at the harbor. It's a painting of a sea serpent. Wait, is it a serpent if it has legs? What do you think, Sally? Ah, thanks for clearing that up. There's nothing written on the barrels. I'm sure they were once filled with some kind of wonderful, unsanctioned local ale. It's the case file. The reason we're here. It was left for us right here on the bar. Captain Seafoam. As far as I know, that's who hired us. And who left the case file here in the inn. But where are they now? Where is anyone? Sally, what do you think? Mm. Great contribution. Lapse. They've stopped giving out light and taken up dust collecting. That's also what I plan to do when I retire. A wooden carving of a fish skeleton. If the windows weren't boarded up, you'd be able to see it from outside. It's what remains of the stone top inn. Looks like it's been closed for some time. Although I don't have any point of reference. Maybe it looked like this when it was still open. A crab. You know, just in case anyone missed the overt nautical theming. It's Sally. She's fast asleep. <sighs> To be fair, it is four in the morning. I agreed to stay awake and see if anyone shows up. So far, nothing. I thought I heard something outside. Hello? There's nothing written on the barrel. I'm sure they were once filled with some kind of wonderful... Sally, wake up. We have to go. Because there's an eerie green light trying to lure us outside. Oh, that's a pretty good reason. I'll get up. It's the stone top emblem, I guess. Looks like a snowman. It's not. Why would it be a snowman? All right, then, what is it? I think it's three stones stacked on top of each other. Oh, that actually does make more sense. It's a billboard for a theater. Baroness Fortuna presents Fortuna Hall. Performing tonight, Waylon Wolf. Oh, tonight? Yeah, we didn't come all this way to go to the theater. Also, the sign is several years old. Are you awake? I thought I was, but maybe not. Maybe this is my dream. It's not a dream. Hmm. That's exactly what Dream Grimoire would say. A large stone statue on top of a fountain. It looks like a fisherman wrestling with some kind of dragon. It says right here, the silkworm serpent. It can't be a serpent. It has legs. Right? 
Another abandoned building. Mr. Grip's Emporium. What do you think they sell? Currently, nothing. There's an old lighthouse up on the rock. Can we go up to the top? Do you have permission from the lighthouse keeper? No. Then no. There's something in the water. What is it? I don't know. But whatever it is, is the source of the green light. Is that...? A submarine. I think I can see someone standing on the deck. Maybe we should go take a look. Looks like it originally said Seafell, but that got crossed out and now it says Mortuga. I'm getting mutiny vibes from this, I don't know about you. It's the wrong way around. What? Take another look at the case file. Looks like it already- I'm getting mutiny vibes from this, I don't know about you. It's the wrong way around. What? Take another look at the case file. An old wooden boy. With a face. This is where the green light was coming from. I noticed it started to fade as soon as we stepped onto the deck. So, it's a boy that doubles as a lighthouse? The opposite, really. A lighthouse warns you to stay away, but this thing lured us in. There's a chain connecting the buoy to the door. So when the foredeck is underwater, the boy floats up above it? That explains how we saw the green light before the submarine actually surfaced. An old rowing boat. Or. Or what? Or. It only has one oar. Oh! So, this is the Mortuga submarine? According to the case file, yeah. And Mortuga is. He was the captain. Now he's the murder victim. Okay, so where's the new captain? Good question. It's the bit that sticks out of the top of the submarine. It's called the sail, or sometimes the fair water. Wait, you know submarine words? Apparently so. There's nobody here. The door's open, though. Somebody must have opened it after the submarine surfaced. Does that constitute an invitation? Ready, Sally? 